I think it's uh, hugely important because it's something that, that there's obviously been a long connection between the club and, and, and all the armed services, you know, the armed forces, and it's something that uh, I think is well received by, by by each of the forces, you know, and, and there's a lot of the work that we do, and especially the work that the charity does, that uh, helps, you know, with the armed forces and it helps with Erskine and, and various courses we run for the the, the veterans when they come out of the army, and, and the other forces as well, which actually does help some of the guys to reintegrate when they're, they're maybe having some issues. Of course, Armed Forces Day at Ibrox on Saturday and a great opportunity to, for the Rangers fans to show just how much they appreciate the service that these guys give for our country. Yeah, and, and the, the fans have shown over the years, you, you know, that, that uh, you know how much th- it means to them, you know, and, and they really do appreciate the, you know, the, the efforts and, and the fact that these, uh, you know, men and women are putting their lives in the line to, to you know, to protect the, the liberty of the country. So, no, I, I'm sure the fans will be there. Well, we know the fans are going to be crowd on Saturday again, which is great. And uh, you know, I'm sure the fans will show their appreciation, you know, for the uh, all the efforts that, that that are made by the armed services. And fantastic for the, the services as well. We even see here with the, the high-ranking officials from the various services here. It means a lot to them to, to have the support from the club. Yeah, no, that, that's been very apparent. You, you know, the the the, the ball been really appreciative of, of the the efforts that the club makes and and that the charity makes, you know, the charitable foundation makes as well. So, so no, that's great. There's a great relationship there. It's a, a very strong relationship and and one that's been there for many years. So you know and and long may it continue, hopefully. Once again, we're here and Rangers are supporting the, the armed services. How much does it mean to all the services to have this backing? Yes, no, thank you very much. And, and it is, it's a really great day. Um, it's it's fantastic because um, clearly, you know, Rangers being such a big team um, and um, and of course we, like um, like anybody in society, you know, have lots of people, lots of soldiers who, um, who support Rangers. So it's really tremendous. Um, but also, you know, afterwards when, um, you know, as, as soldiers are there part of the community and when they come out of the services, um, you know, and also, for the, for the airmen and, and sailors as well, um, you know, to know that uh, that big organisations like Rangers, um, you know, ha- have them in their minds and support them is just tremendous. Um, so no, a really great day, really big day. It's Armed Forces Day at Ibrook Stadium on Saturday and fantastic to see both the club giving something back and showing appreciation for those who serve the country but giving those who do serve the country the chance to take a bit of adulation. Oh yes, um, and they will absolutely adore that. Um, I mean, I think it was um, it was proved to be a very popular event and a tremendous event and um, certainly when they're put in the spotlight, um, you know, there's um, no question they like to shine. But um, but really tremendous also that it's, it's you know, so public um, that, that Rangers are, are showing their, their backing and the support for the military. So... We're hugely appreciative of that and um, no, it'll be great.